Hello everyone, this is CypherDeck and today we're back on Corleone and I am going to do a walkthrough of all of his equipment as people have been asking me everywhere I go. Um, so yeah, let's just start with his weapon. Uh, one of his weapons, which is the exquisite Villian Brawl Stick. I got this on him only to get the skill up. It's not uh, that I use it very often, um, but... For skill ups, it's a it's a great weapon to have. Uh, his other primary weapon, the one that I use the most, is the uh, Devastator, or the I'm sorry, the Deathbringer, which is 1622, and um, it's nice. It's a nice weapon. Um, as far as shields, I have two shields that I run. Uh, if I need more mana uh, and health, then I'll go with the Orb of Infinite Void. If I need more charisma, I go with uh, this shield, which is the Shield of the White Dragon. And uh, it's more of the charisma that I go with. Uh, the resists are nice. And I'll probably use this if I ever do Vox on this tune. But yeah, it's a it's an overall nice, uh, nice shield. And then I also have my Epic on me, which I cannot equip because I'm only level 23 and uh so yeah that's the weapons that I have for him currently so overall his armor is uh sky shrine armor um so you can see here uh but he does have the vibrating gauntlets from um Trudok. and soon for boots I am going to have the white dragon scale boots i'm turning in the white dragon scale helm hence why i'm at uh yellow next layer to turn those into the two flowing thought boots which by the way this <laughs> the sound by itself is amazing um but i'd rather have the boots so that's what i'm going to do with that now i have a whole other set of armor that i run and that is mostly <laughs> for fashion uh, but it also has, the whole set is charisma. So we'll go ahead and change that over real quick. And there we go. So this is my whole charisma set right here, uh, including the shield. Um, that puts me at my maximum charisma, which still isn't too high. I'm trying to see if there's any, oh, um, I can swap out, uh, earrings. I have a Yanub earring, and then I also have both the earring of purity and the earring of cleansing, um, that I can put on him as well. But we'll go ahead and change out these two earrings, and that puts us at 144 charisma, which is my max charisma. Go ahead and change these back out. And then going from the top to the bottom, uh, we have... The Iron Scroll of War off of the statue. I uh, got this because it had the 50 mana on it. 35 AC, which is a lot of AC. The thing is, you never want to click it. Because if you click it, it's instant. And it is consumable. So it will go away once you've uh, clicked it twice. Um, as far as rings, I just have normal Villium rings. I want to upgrade those at some point. Uh, for shoulders, until I can get the weight of the gods, I have the barbed uh, dragon scale pauldrons. Um, uh, for my back, I have a Lodi shield, uh, just because it has, again, charisma, has strength, which is good for uh, my melee. And um, again, another nice high AC item on my back slot. Now, for my, uh, my, my uh, mask, I use this whenever I'm not fighting, and then I have the eye patch of plunder for whenever I am fighting. Adds 50 hit points, again, melee stats, and also has, I think it's a 22 or 23% haste, so it's a nice little item to have. Uh, going over to neck, I have a yelling neck, which has 41% haste on it. And, uh, by the way, this took me years. <laughs> it wasn't an overnight kind of thing. It took me a long time before this character was ready to go. And I wouldn't level him until I had met certain, um, obligations as far as what I wanted on the character. I do have a, uh, I have two breastplates, by the way, that I didn't show 
which are the chest plate of vindication for region and also the Donald's breastplate of mourning for the complete heal buff. Uh, going down, um, we got a spike seahorse uh, belt. And I think that's everything for for the armor and what he's actually wearing currently. Uh, if I missed anything, I do apologize. Now let's talk about the things that I don't have on him. I have J-Boots. I have the uh, Bracer of the Hidden. I have a uh, Levy Cloak. I have an OVP, which I can't click yet. Uh, I think I need to be a little bit higher for that. I have a Leatherfoot uh, cap, because everyone should have one of those. I have a chip bone rod. I think everyone should have one of those, especially if you're looking for a corpse in a zone like fear or something like that. Um, it's, it's just something that I carry with me. Uh, earring, uh, blazing energy. I need, to, uh, that was given to me. So I need to pass that off. Uh, I have one charge left on my prayers of life, uh, which is what I handed to this character. I believe with, uh, with one charge. Then we can get into the insane items that I have on my character, like a small Manasini plant, which, uh, you can click it and it summons bandages. <laughs> it's a 50, it's a 40 or 50 K item for bandages. And the only reason I got it is because I wanted to min max. I wanted to be able to make sure that I was able to get my bind wound to max because even though I will never use it, most likely, on anybody else, it does, as a cleric, give you the ability to bind wound up to 70%. Huh? So, I figured, I figured I'd go ahead and get it uh, just because. And then, finally, the last item on this character um, is the Amulet of Necropancy, which I have always wanted, and whenever I got it, this was the first character I knew I was going to put it on. So, uh, so yeah, I had, that is my tune. One only other thing that I can show is that I'm one idol away from my tune arb racer, and that I also have everything to get the Garzacor, um, the Garzacor earring, and then I will be, uh, set for a long time on this character. So that is my character as he is currently at level 23 at 46. I will pause probably again and that's when I will move to get my uh, weight of the gods, my plane of sky necklace for complete heal and, um, and anything else that I can get my hands on for this character. So, uh, hopefully you enjoyed. If you have any questions, let me know. And, uh, if you ever want to see my warrior's gear, I can do that as well. But he is not as geared as this character is. This is probably the most, uh, time and money I've spent on a single tune. Uh, so, uh, there is, there is that. So, uh, thank you all for watching. This is Cypher Deck. Hopefully you enjoyed. Peace out.